Hi Tekla users, welcome to the Tekla tool and tips video. In our previous video, Voltage Cassette Connection number 11, we have learned that uh, how to place the connections, uh, base connections and column lines. Today we will learn how to place the connection and the intersection of the two basings. For this, first what we will do, we will split any one of the base okay so go to the steel search for split before that we will place uh, two point one point mm, point point on line here this one point will become here and now go to the split select and hit the point our base is split into two members ok now go to the application and component ok and here we have right 11 connection voltage gusset double click on that ok uh, Connections window will be open. For select the main base, then pick the one splitted and another splitted and middle mouse button. Okay, close it. This one. Okay. So, uh, as you can see, that window is already open. Uh, uh, we need to change this cassette uh, plate uh, shape. So. Uh, we will uh, provide the one inch and uh, one inch here to extend the plate uh, uh, come out from the base so pick the component and modify it will be come you can use it here is coming one sorry one One, four. Now we go. Okay. Uh, uh, we need to change its uh, shape also and provide some angle. Let's provide twenty to five, twenty five. Okay. So shape is going to change. Uh, twenty five is much. Let's provide it twenty. the component and modify it it's fine and uh, uh, this is the dimensions uh, uh, from uh, from the base to the main base and let's provide it one okay so let's pick the component and uh, check the particular dimensions will be one Pick this perpendicular one as we have put over there. Okay, uh, we draw it. Okay, come on the um, gusset gusset tab where we can change as in the previous section we have changed the thickness. So, here also we can change the thickness. Okay, and uh, come on the gusset bolt. Gusset bolt uh, here we can uh, 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 there is a uh, one option right now it is uh, by default it is set no bolt uh, on the main beam uh, main sorry main base and gusset so because it is selected uh, selected that's why uh, let's select it what will be happen component this bolt is coming okay let's change the diameter of the bolt uh, it's a standard and by default uh, uh, because it's a standard bolt and we will uh, provide one by 16 uh, tolerance modify it uh, all the size standard tolerance has been changed according to this so for this okay this page and uh, here the another options is uh, here side and workshop uh, by default it is coming at side 
if you want to change it uh, shop select the workshop and change see the color also for the workshop is red okay uh, so you can change uh, the type of the bolt uh, uh, from this drop down and uh, here the another options is uh, uh, for this uh, bolt that uh, is middle okay next uh, the one thing here the, this section is for the uh, number of bolt let's provide here three okay okay and uh, there is a there are three to four uh, uh, options over there let's select the bottom and provide the two okay this will happen okay so uh, this this uh, two will be maintained from here here and uh, this is for the bolt to bolt dimensions so if i am providing here 2.5 so it would be like 2.5 2.5 okay and 2 from the bottom let's change it uh, from the top okay so this two uh, will be maintained from here from the right side of the cassette edge okay and uh, what will be happen if I, I will select it from the middle and uh, just uh, remove it okay so check perpendicular dimension is same from both of the side and as we have uh, right there 2 1 by 2 is the bolt to bolt distance okay so you can change the things from here and what is the use of this this is also for the auto middle and right and uh, uh, right now uh, I am changing it from the right and writing over there too. So, two. It is coming from this back of the angle. If I am changing it from the middle and removing it, what would be happen? This is back of the angle 4 and back of the uh, edge of the angle 4 that is 4 4 equals 4 side of the angle. Okay, so these are this is the use of this uh, bolt uh, size standard tolerance and here you can pro provide the number of the number of bolt space between here you can maintain the bolt uh, group from the uh, uh, from the middle bottom top and also in the vertical di direction middle and right and come on the uh, base bolt uh, one tab here you can maintain this is for this uh, any of this left check for okay so change the bolt the uh, size and uh, this uh, standard here let's provide it from the middle uh, and uh, uh, middle because we have maintained it from the middle so no need to provide any uh, anything any numerical value here but uh, uh, I uh, just um, uh, uh, give the demonstration for this uh, tab in the last video you can refer part one for this okay let's provide three number of holes and uh, here uh, no no three no, not three it will be come from the uh, vertical engine vertical rows three okay here uh, three mm, uh, bolt to bolt dimension this is for the number of bolt okay and uh, this is uh, the edge distance uh, from the
so you can check that three number of bolt is coming uh, the dimension between them is between the bolt to bolt is three three sorry three and uh, as we have provided two one by two voltage distance on the facet and on the base edge sorry to be more it is three okay the same way uh, uh, you can uh, change the bolt for this uh, brace also by uh, leveling the brace bolt to tab change the the uh, of the bolt uh, standard tolerance and uh, here also you can select the middle uh, the spacing is 2.5 2.5 uh, the number of bolt 3 and the uh, and dimension between uh, bolt to bolt to provide 3 so picking the component just pick the component and modify it so all will be changed so it's yes, very simple uh, two tab uh, uh, how to modify the two tab you can uh, refer also the part one and uh, in this uh, the middle uh, you can uh, play with this uh, uh, this um, options okay and uh, yeah you can uh, change the shape of the gusset weight according to your project requirement okay uh, thank you for uh, watching the video thanks